in the history of literature about heaven? This is a funny question because I've been asked this question a number of times. And just recently, I was speaking to a group of people and someone asked this question, how old will we be in heaven? And um, I think the answer to that is we don't know. Uh, but I, I, I do know that the church has had a, a variety of answers. One is that we will be the age of Adam and Eve when they were created, which doesn't really help us. Uh, because we don't know how old they were, but we w- we could say that they were functioning and mature adults. Others have said we will be the age of Jesus at his crucifixion. This seems to be a very pious answer for which there's absolutely no other evidence. But I would say this, that we will be in the new heavens and the new earth, uh, an age that is at our maximal powers, that we will be mature adults, But I have a sneaking suspicion that those of us who have lost children uh, at birth or who have had children who've died in a young age prior to their maturity or their age uh, development will either get to see them age into maturity and grow into maturity or they will get to know what life for that person as a child would have been like. So I just think that we have to think of heaven as an embodied life where everything is made right. And part of making things right is the injustices or the tragedies that we experienced in this world. We will see them come undone and unraveled and re-raveled the way God's perfect world would have them put together. So that's a good question, and I think the answer is we don't know. But I I would say that the evidence seemed to suggest that we will be mature adults in heaven.